In this quick video guide, I want to show you a really interesting plugin which can be used to create a contact form in your website if you're using WordPress, of course. So here we are in the WordPress dashboard plugin section. I'm just going to type here contact form and there you go. So we're going to see this tool right here, which is called WP Forms. And this is used to create and customize forms. And you can create basically any type of forms, anything that you need. There is a free version, which is uh, really fast and easy to use, and also a professional version that you can decide if you want to buy. Now, if you go here, you can just install and wait until it's um, um, it appears the activation button and then click and activate it. Now, once it's activated, you will see it right here. So usually it will start with a, a page, a welcome page with a wizard, but you can also access that later. So if you close everything, you will find it here. You will find here all the, the settings and everything. Now we're going to go in the add new section. So we're going to add a new and right now it's in Italian, but you can see basically that you're going to start by giving your contact form a name right here on the top. And then you will select a template and you can see that all the templates here are in English. So if you want here, you can just select one of these and well, let's try for example, here the automobile information form and use this template. Now WP forms as its own dashboard, its own interface. So you can get here and you will have settings and other fields and also I believe language somewhere. So let's go to the settings here. And again, we are back. You can see to the, to the template page. And let me try to see here. Well, unfortunately, I'm not seeing the, the language, but essentially what you, what you need to do here, once you create your form, which is this one, so this is for, again, automobile, but you can just click on these modules and you can customize them right here. So you can change the, the text. Or you can also delete if you want a field that, uh, or you don't want a field, you can just delete it, recreate it. There you go. So let's delete this one here, for example. I'm going to click on this little bin and that's it. And also you can continue to add other modules. Again, I'm sorry this is in um, Italian, but it's really easy. This is a, a simple paragraph. And then you have multiple choices. Well, you need to wait yeah, until this one is uh, you know, finished. You can also set this to be necessary or you know, uh, the, the form will not be sent. And there you have like multiple choice and you have check boxes, you have drop down menus, radio buttons, numbers, and email is already there. Usually there you go, name and other stuff. Now you have some standard fields, some advanced fields, and also fields to pay, but these are I believe in the professional version right here. But you can do a lot just with the, the standard fields and the standard form. Now, when you're ready, you're going to save this. And if you want to use it in a page, just close everything. And again, you can follow the wizard at the beginning, or you can just do it like manually like this. But essentially, you can see you have now here in the VP forms page, you have, I have two forms. So one is the previous one that I created and the other one is, uh, is this one that we just created together. When you want to add it to a page, you just need to go inside a page. So for example, if I'm going to create a new page or, or a new post or wherever, I can just call this contact us. So this will be like the, the title of the page. And then I will insert a block and look for VP forms. And if it's not shown, you can just type it like this and click. And there you go. Now you just need to select which 
module which form you want to insert so it's going to be my contact form and there you go now this is everything we create and set up and customize in our module now i'm not gonna save this because i don't need it really it's just an example for you and this will be all for this video guide you will see also you have a lot of settings but also you have like in um you know information in the various pages dedicated so i'm gonna exit here dedicated to the VP forms so here you have like a bunch of settings and add-ons and things that you can see if you if you need it but it's just like the standard contact form really easy really quick completely free thanks to wordpress so this will be all for this video guide if you enjoyed please subscribe to the channel and if you want to give us a little thank you you can just support the channel by joining as a supporter check our other videos and courses that you will find in the channel again thanks and see you in the next